I'm Dr. Deepak Chopra, inviting you to be a participant in the research on self-directed biological transformation. Recently, at the Chopra Center for Wellbeing through the Chopra Foundation, we studied the levels of the enzyme telomerase in participants who were at a retreat called the Seduction of Spirit. In this course, they learn uh, meditation, self-awareness, self-reflection, transcendence, conscious choice making. In this course, they also practice yoga and breathing techniques. Within four days of our course, the participants that we studied, we saw that their telomerase level went up by 40%. Our research was in collaboration with scientists at uh, UCSF, UCSD, uh, Scripps, and also Harvard University and Mount Sinai. When we saw this dramatic increase in telomerase, which is the enzyme that controls or influences uh, aging at a cellular level, we then, uh, based on this, and looked at the entire genome and what we found was that all the genes that uh, influenced homeostasis were upregulated which means genes and gene networks acted in such a way that homeostasis or self-regulation was enhanced furthermore genes that uh, influenced inflammation and were connected directly or indirectly with diseases such as Alzheimer's, type 2 diabetes, heart disease, and many other chronic uh, conditions where inflammation is a background, were downregulated. In other words, their activity went down. Overall, gene networks behaved in a way that optimizes well being, self regulation, and homeostasis. Based on this, uh, and the uh, results of the last study are pending right now, publication. We're writing the paper right now. Based on this, we are now embarking on a new study called Self-Directed Biological Transformation, or SBTI, Self-Directed Biological Transformation. In this study, we'll be looking at the effects of meditation, uh, breathing techniques, um, diet, which is plant-based with high fiber content, uh, oils and adaptogens, which are ingested and also are used in massage. The reason for diet and oils being ingested and used in massage is to change the microbiome. We have 6 trillion cells in our body, of which only 10% are human. The rest are bacteria. So you and I are a bacterial colony walking around with a few human cells and all of this system has created also a brain that uh, we can use for self-awareness it's really amazing in any case the new study will include sleep meditation movement changing the microbiome massage diet um, and uh, healthy emotions uh, such as love, compassion, joy, equanimity that will um, be enhanced through certain mental techniques. And then we'll look at the entire genome again. We'll look at um, cellular markers for both information uh, that gives us a clue to inflammation as well as homeostasis. So some of the things that we've done before but also this time looking at the microbiome, the genes of the microbiome and how they interact with the human genes uh, to optimize our well-being. We expect really good results based on our last study and we feel that once we have scientifically documented this uh, whole process, uh, we'll have created the science for optimizing health, based on holistic principles, optimizing self-regulation, self-repair mechanisms, and changing uh, 
the aging process at a cellular level. This is a very exciting study, uh, the Chopra Foundation and its donors will be uh, seeding uh, the budget, in other words providing the seed funding, but we invite all of you to participate in uh, making the study possible. Uh, the benefits to you, the benefits to society, the benefits to science um, will be enormous. Uh, I will be updating you on how you can participate, on how you can contribute, what benefits you may obtain from the study, and how you may further the um, emergence of a new paradigm in science, self-directed biological transformation. Thank you so much.